A 17 million gallon sewage spill at LA's largest treatment plant has closed several South Bay beaches. One of those is Dockweiler State Beach in Playa del Rey. KCAL 9's Joy Benedict spoke with campers and has a warning for swimmers and surfers. Things were calm along the coast today at Dockweiler State Beach, but in the summer in Southern California, that's a sign something is wrong. They indicated that we probably shouldn't get into the water until they get some more information. Those staying at the RV park are watching the waves from a distance. After 17 million gallons of unfiltered sewage flooded the shore from the Hyperion water treatment plant nearby. I uh, actually walked the dog past the sewage plant and saw that it was uh, overflowing in their parking structure. The DGORGIOs say the sewage even backed up into the office trailer at the park. That's when he told me their, their toilet was overflowing and coming back out into the, the guard shack itself. But that was Sunday when a a spokesperson for the Hyperion plant says they were inundated with an overwhelming quantity of debris, causing a backup at headquarters. Officials tell us to relieve the backup. They opened the one mile pipe for eight hours, releasing 17 million gallons of raw sewage, material that is usually displaced using the five mile pipe to keep it away from shore. It happens occasionally, but uh, not often, so we're not too, too concerned about it. I know that they're going to take care of it. But others are very concerned. Our poor beaches. I mean, we've never seen the beach this dirty, I'm going to be honest. We rode our bikes yesterday and there's a lot of garbage on the beach and now the sewage. It's kind of sad. According to the nonprofit group Heal the Bay, the last major overflow at the plant was in 2015. But the group says there have been about 75 smaller sewage spills in the last 18 months in L.A. County, sending more than 300,000 gallons of sewage into our lakes, rivers and streams. Hopefully they get it resolved quickly. But many beachgoers say they aren't deterred by the announcement as there is so much more to enjoy on the coast besides the water. We're going to continue coming and we're going to continue enjoying the beach. We love it here. Hyperion says it has actually made many equipment improvements to the plant in recent years, including in-house storm basins to actually pump debris back into the plant instead of the ocean. And then, of course, catch basins to try and prevent debris from flowing into the ocean. It's not clear yet what caused this backup. From Dockweiler State Beach, I'm Joy Benedict, KCAL 9 News.